Hey everyone, this is the next video in the series about inside Spring Boot. So far, we have covered all this topic, internal architecture, starters, auto configuration, and also we have explored this run method in Spring Boot applications, right? So this video, we are going to talk about the dependency management and all of the above links, uh, all of the other video links are given in the description box. Go ahead and check out that. This video, we are going to talk about the dependency management part, how dependency is managed how they are being downloaded some of these part i have um, some of this dependency section i have covered in starters and auto configuration and we will add uh, more information into that right let me take you to the hello world application and show you this step by step so if i show you how to create the project so this is the start.spring.io where we create the spring boot application we want gradle and just to show you i want this spring web dependency right and see what is structure it has generated right so this is the build.gradle this is the main thing that we want to explore right so this has plugins id group source compatibility repositories and dependencies starter web this dependency section even doesn't have the mention doesn't have mention of the version but still it is able to download all the dependencies right so let me download this uh, download this zip project and open this in intellij idea so this is the hello world application that i already have open in intellij idea and this is the build.gradle that we are looking at right and main part is here dependencies so when you added this starter web so if you watch the previous video where i have explained spring starter uh, how many starters are there and how do they work so you have this one only and it has downloaded all the dependencies with specific version so where these versions are mentioned right so from where all of this is coming so in gradle so gradle is a build tool there is another which is maven so in case of gradle these plugins org spring framework boot and dependency management these two plugins are doing the magic so we have mentioned here spring boot version 2.2.5. release so all of this spring boot starter web whatever compatible with this version is going to get downloaded right here here in this so you can get list of the dependencies that are there in starter web uh, in the folder here so if i show you this is starter web here here it is right so if i show you this so in explorer and come back one folder above and here here is the form right so here you will see all the all the related dependencies that it needs right and with all the with all the dependency that it needs with along with the version all of this it has downloaded all right so so if if someone asks who is responsible for managing the dependencies and how it is being taken care so these are the answer is these two plugins in case of gradle these are the two plugins that are responsible for this right so if you want to so the next question comes so all the dependencies uh, they are uh, configured previously they are already configured coming configured all the compatible versions right and uh, uh, what if i want to use my own dependency i have some custom requirement for example this starter web has imb uh, embedded tomcat right so it has starter tomcat right this one and for this it is uh, it is using version 2.2.5 release but for some reason i want uh, some previous release right so previous version 2.2.4 2.2.3 how we can do that so to do that we have to follow two steps first remove first of all exclude this dependency from this starter and then add manually the other one that you want right so let me show you how you can exclude a particular dependency from here right so for simplicity so when you download the project it already has one syntax right so from the starter test it is already excluding this when test this dependency right so the same thing we can use uh, in, in in this part and we can exclude it right so use this one exclude and mention the name of the group 
and group is the same here. And module is spring started, not the web but Tomcat. Right? So that's it. We need this only. Now the Tomcat started Tomcat dependencies will be removed from the external dependencies, right? So if you come here and look for the Tomcat, you won't get anything because you have excluded this. Now I want to add uh, my own version of the Tomcat. How we can do this? So follow the same lines here. So this is the there is syntax consistency that you can use. So implement this and here replace this one with Tomcat. Right. And now I have to mention the version also because I want my own. So 2.2.4.3. I want this one, right? So let the dependency download it. And if I show you now, Tom, show you the dependency. So it has uh, downloaded this, one, right? This 2.2.4, right? So, but uh, this exclusion and adding your own version should be done very carefully because uh, Spring uh, Spring Boot is following a release train with the starter web. They have uh, added all the compatible dependencies uh, that is needed, right? So uh, sometimes you will uh, you might face some issues when you overwrite the versions, some compatibility issue, right? So do it carefully, right? So this is about the Dependency management when you are using Gradle. In case you are using Maven, you can get that information as well. So if you come here, it is the depend official documentation based dependency management, right? So this is for the Maven part where you have the concept of parent form and all other stuffs. You can go ahead and see the information about here. And if you want to know about the Spring Boot Gradle plugin, that is there for dependency management. All other informations are given here right so detailed information and more about the dependency management plugin is given here right so you can get that information right here so this is the short introduction about this dependency management right so this is how it works right so i hope you learned something from it so all other videos are given in the description box go ahead and check out that i'll see you in the next video with the other topic right? take care bye bye